More Line 3 pipeline protests today and more arrests as well, including apparently Winona LaDuke, the executive director of Honor the Earth. According to a press release from Honor the Earth, about 40 protesters sat together in solidarity at the Shell River near Park Rapids in opposition of the Line 3 pipeline project, which will cross underneath the Shell River. Honor the Earth reports seven women were arrested, including LaDuke. Meanwhile, Enbridge Energy says their Line 3 oil pipeline replacement project is now more than 70 percent complete. Enbridge officials say this includes horizontal directional drilling at over a dozen sites. According to Enbridge, HDD is the preferred construction method for pipelines crossing bodies of water and involves drilling a tunnel under a designated area and then pulling a pipeline or other utility through. Enbridge says Line 3 is a safety and maintenance driven project that will replace an aging pipeline with a safer one made of thicker steel with more advanced coatings. And Governor Tim Walz is standing by his support for the project. Walz told the Duluth News Tribune during an interview last week, quote, I think I have a very progressive environmental record, but I'm also a realist and we need to move oil and we need to move it safely. So I said we are going to replace an aging pipeline because that's what the law says. The project has stood up in court. Replacement work has been completed in Canada, North Dakota and Wisconsin. The project is slated to be completed and in service by the fourth quarter of this year. Lakeland News is member supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.